Hello, everybody, and thank you so much for joining us um, for our virtual poor talk. Let me read your future. Tomorrow morning, you will wake up, you will open the curtains in your stateroom, and uh, you look outside and you'll say, oops, I'm in the middle of nowhere. And guess what? You are right. But this middle of nowhere has a huge importance in Hungarian history, religion, culture, and economy. Tomorrow, it's your last port of call in Hungary. Tomorrow, we are in Kalocha. Kalocha lies 142 kilometers, which is around 88 miles south of Budapest, on the left bank of the Danube. Historically, it had greater political and economic importance than at present. It's said that uh, King Stephen, Stephen the Saint, Stephen the Great, created here a religious center around the year 1000. The city suffered a lot from the Ottoman invasion in the 16th century and after that, in 1875, was destroyed by fire. The industrial development of the 19th and 20th century did not come to Kalocha. The first railway was built too late in 1882. Tomorrow is the last day when you can use the local currency Hungarian for it. Uh, after that, uh, uh, nowhere on your trip they will accept uh, for payment in shops. And you lose uh, because of the exchange rate if you want to exchange uh, Hungarian foreigns in your own currency. So tomorrow, spend them all. <laughs> Tomorrow, during uh, a visit to a local farm, you'll have the chance to get the most wanted photo in Kalocha. Ten in hand. Uh, a lovely story behind, a lot of skills involved, and for you, a beautiful memory. The must-have shopping tomorrow in Kalocha, it's of course the famous Hungarian paprika and I hope you didn't spend all your money in Budapest because uh, tomorrow in Kalocha the prices are up to 7% lower than the one in Budapest. Paprika came to Europe in the 16th century thanks to the doctor of Christopher Columbus, Diego Czarnaka, and uh, entered Hungary in the 16th century. There are documents from 1570 mentioning the, the red Turkish pepper. Paprika became a popular part of the cuisine in Hungary in 1780 and today one of the most popular TV channels in Hungary is TV Paprika, a channel broadcasting cooking programs. Tomorrow in Kalocha you'll have two chances to buy paprika. One in the little shop in the Bakot farm, in the horse farm. And the second is this little house just in front of uh, our docking position, uh, a kind of a souvenir shop. My suggestion is to find the best price for you. What I would do, first uh, I will leave the ship a little bit earlier before the excursion to have time to check the prices in the shop opposite our docking position. And when we arrive uh, at the farm, I have time uh, to check the prices there and to decide which price is better for me. Because in your return back to the ship, you will still have time to stop a couple of minutes in the little white shop uh, next to our docking position. But definitely, you need to buy some paprika. Now, very important question. How many types of paprika you can find? Uh, so, uh, you have... Uh, the hot one, that's excellent for uh, spicy stews or just season it a bit um, a roast. You have the mild one, which is good in everything. Uh, you have uh, the sweet one, which is excellent for salads, cold salads. Uh, and something new, you have the smoked one. It's one in the little uh, yellow sachet and that's absolutely divine for stew. Uh, it's hard to decide which type of paprika you want. And if you don't have a PhD in paprika, my advice is buy all of them. For those of you that you want to stay on board, uh, but you like to try some local food, I have a solution for you. Not very far from the ship, maybe five minutes walk. It's an excellent restaurant. You leave the ship, you turn left, you follow the main road and you'll see in two minutes on the left-hand side, it's a little road taking you 
all the way to this uh, restaurant located on the bank of the river. What I would do there, definitely I'll spend a lot of time because I love Hungarian food, but for you I'll recommend the Hungarian fresh fish soup made with carp and uh, uh, the local version of profiteroles, shomloi, absolutely delicious. Uh, by the way, payments, um, they accept uh, credit cards, all the major credit cards, uh, local currency, the foreign or even euros. So uh, that's all for today. Uh, enjoy your day in Kalocha and don't forget, keep hoping, keep cruising, we will be back. <laughs>